Hello girls! Welcome to another episode of Asli Side Lip Eyes. I totally feel like there's a halo right above like oh. and I also feel like you know I could be an alien who just landed on earth like yeah okay so let's get to the questions shall we just had a long day at work I hope you had a great day today so on to question number one okay okay question number one is from Aisha Samuin hello Aisha hi Kalisa hello I've been watching your answer videos from the start and have to say I absolutely adore the tone of your voice eh? and the way you speak. <laughs> it's mature and adorable all at the same time. Thank you. I'm sure you get compliments all the time. How do you cope with it? Especially in front of the person saying it. I always stammer and deny whenever anyone compliment me and it's not cool. Any tips to accept it graciously? Hmm. Okay, to be honest, um, Aisha, before, uh, I used to not accept compliments really well. Um, you know, if anybody were to say something nice to me, I used to say, no lah, or something like that. And then my mom would correct me and say, hey, you know, if anybody said anything nice to you or give you a compliment, just accept it. Um, be thankful and appreciate it. And I took it in that sense, you know, if anybody said anything nice to you, just be thankful and, you know, and say thank you, you know, and if you have anything nice to say to the person, you can always say it back, but if you don't, just don't say it, <laughs> yeah, but you know, you know what I mean, right, Aisha, you'll be fine, don't worry about it, okay, so uh, when, when, you, when you say, um, you always stammer, I think it's just because you're shy, right? You shy. I'm sure you're a very cute girl. That's why you shy, shy one. But you don't have to be la. If anybody give you a compliment, just say, "Oh, really? Thank you." And there you go. Right? Is that okay? All right. Thank you for your questions, Aisha. Mwah. Question number two, two, two is from Raihana Hanif. Hmm, Raihana. A a a. Salam and hello, my lovely Kalisa. Salam and hello. How you manage to handle your emotions? Ah. Selalu tengok Kalisa all the time happy, tak ada moody. Padahal Kalisa shoot kadang-kadang sampai midnight or morning kan. So any tips? Hmm. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, how do I handle my emotions? All the time happy, eh? Um. I think I try to. Uh. Think positively as much as possible. I think that's what I do. I do get angry sometimes. I do get sad sometimes. I do. Yeah, I do. I do. Um, it's just that, you know, I try to not think negatively in a long time. You know, kadang-kadang, kalau, kalau kita rasa fresh ke, bengang ke, pasal apa-apa, kalau boleh, saya tak nak fikirlah lama. Uh, macam itulah. Uh, kalau boleh kita nak fikirkan apa uh, penye penyelesaiannya dan kemudiannya kita bergerak ke depan you know itu yang Lisa cuba buat lah tapi bila adik cakap macam ni apa, apa tu padahal kakak shoot kadang-kadang sampai midnight morning kan dan semua tu sebahagian daripada kerja kerja kat Lisa nak macam mana kan tentang penat-penat tu kerja mana-mana bidang pun penat betul tak kan so macam mana pun kita think positif insyaAllah ok ya yeah? So hope that was okay for you, Raihana. Eh, eh, eh. I like your name lah. Huh? Good luck, girl. Question number three. Question number three is from Fatin Shafika. Hi, Kak Lisa. Hi, Fatin. Okay. Soalan yang saya nak tanya ialah bagaimana untuk membina keyakinan diri bila bercakap di hadapan orang ramai? Kadang-kala saya rasa macam takut dan segan bila bercakap di hadapan orang ramai. Eye contact sangat penting bila bercakap. Tetapi bila dah eye contact dengan audience, mesti akan rasa takut dan segan secara tiba-tiba. Kak Lisa boleh bagi cadangan tak bagaimana nak mengatasi situasi ini? Okey, Fatin saya akan cuba. Hmm, sebenarnya Kak Lisa faham sangat uh, perasaan Fatin. Uh, apa yang Fatin rasa tu macam stage fright. And sebenarnya stage fright ni adalah sesuatu yang common uh, Orang yang profesional pun boleh rasa juga um, Tapi uh, uh, apa yang orang rasa tu 
Biasanya sebelum naik ke pentas Lepas bila dah naik pentas Lepas beberapa saat Boleh rasa okey Betul tak? Kan? Tentang eye contact tu dengan audience tu Bagi bagi saya uh, Mungkin pandang audience macam secara seluruhan Daripada pandang seorang, seorang, seorang Mungkin itu boleh membantu Untuk Fatin tidak rasa terlalu nervous um, Dan uh, lagi satu adalah Sebelum uh, naik ke pentas yang penting practice makes perfect. Jadi berlatihlah banyak supaya uh, Fatin rasa lebih yakin uh, dengan apa yang Fatin nak hujahkan. Okay, I hope that was okay, Fatin. Alright, okay, okay tak? All the best and good luck. Don't worry, I'm sure you'll do it. Apa, you you be able to do it. Okay, good luck, girl. Okay, thank you so, so much, girls. Finito for today. Stay tuned to Ask Lisa at Lip Eyes. Just visit the Lip Eyes page on Facebook. And keep the questions coming in because you never know. Because you might get your questions answered. You never know. Ask me anything and everything, okay? I'm going to go and sleep and rest now. Love you, girls.